Greetings, fellow traveler. I want to remind you that the only thing that's needed is an open heart. When you're working on yourself, when you're working on your life, when you're going about your way, keep an open heart. Know what you desire out of the day, out of the moment. And you'll be surprised how the universe, God, coincides with what you want. This can be challenging when we're separated from who we truly are. One of the things I found helpful for myself was physically separating myself from others. Because in doing so, it allowed me to filter out what was of my wanting and doing and what was of their wanting and doing. See, at times along our journey, we can be asleep. We truthfully be asleep till we get to that wake up moment or that wake up call, whatever it is for us. Sometimes it could be with our friends, co-workers, strangers, intimate partners. It all just depends on where we are along our journey. Sometimes we must isolate, keep ourselves or have a place where we can go and be by ourselves physically, but better yet, most importantly, mentally. Have a place where you can really think about your thoughts, where you can observe your thoughts and see what's going on within you. Because when we don't do that, we can find ourselves sleeping with the enemy. Whether that be intimate partners, friends, or anybody else, we could be asleep with them, going along mindlessly, doing things out of tradition or doing things because somebody else told us that's how it should be. Intimate partners, we could physically be sleeping with the enemy, meaning we could be sleeping with somebody who doesn't mean us any good and they don't know any different, so they believe they're doing right by you. Nah. You must trust yourself. You must allow your relationship with God to become stronger and stronger because you will see and learn and hear so many various things over your life. But when God speaks to you, it's the thing. You'll know it. And when God speaks to you, it's fulfilling. It gives you a rewarding sense of, okay, I'm not crazy. I'm not tripping. I'm going to leave at this moment. I'm going to simply tell you to be blessed. And please don't forget to smile.